everyone, and welcome back to Suits of Gaming. We are going to you our gay woods. Welcome to Paraguay Woods. Paraguay. Paraguay. Uruguay. All right, so this is another one where you can choose um, what options you would like to. Uh, what do you mean, what options? Uh, what, what battle options you would like to use? What do you mean, what battle options? We will see. That up down arrow and down arrows. What are you talking about? It, when we get into the battle, we will see. Oh. And I will explain my decision making oh, at that oh, point. I see what you're saying. I yeah. Go up, go up, go up, go up. Water. Go up, go up, go up. Why do they have to make them talk? <laughs> they have vocal cords. I've not seen a chocobo so deep in the woods. An animal painted bird to wander in this goblin ridden place. Now, we can choose to have the battle be defeat all enemies, or we can have it be to save Baco. Save Baco? Who is Baco? The chocobo. Oh, okay. Boko the so chocobo. So, what happens if we. Oh, is it Boko? Save that makes him. Does he join our party? Yes. Just messing around. Do we want the chocobo in our party? I want the two extra bravery points that come so with saving him. we can dismiss him immediately. Perhaps we could use him? Delita once mentioned that wild chocobos were hardier than domesticated breeds. Perhaps we could use him. Now this makes the battle a bit harder, but still really not that hard. You intend to save the creature? I had rather line my purse with gill than feathers. But it's long term. Still, it may help us save the princess. Perhaps we can do both. Screw you, yeah, princess. Yeah, right? Gafgarian, you short-sighted fool. I'm out of here, loser. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he's southern now. Yeah. Wow. Okay, that's fine. Uh, our party is strong, so it's... All Boko needs to do is run into the corner. The hobgobs aren't going to attack him, are they? They are. Oh. But if he hides in that corner, he can only get attacked once a turn. But seriously, though, look at Gafgarian. Take off the armor, put on a duster, put him on a horse. <laughs> He's straight from the southwest. Uh, partner. Partner. His attitude is very gunslayer. Give me all your money. Man, yeah, right? I'm looking for money. Nothing less, nothing, nothing more. more. Maybe sometimes some whiskey. Oh yeah, dude, we're gonna have some fun with that. But then, but then, what would he say to Ram? To uh, well, to, what would he say to Tommy? Because Tommy's not your ordinary southwestern companion. Well, you gotta treat him like a square. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, time is a flat circle. <laughs> I guess that's more of a Matthew McConaughey. Time answer. is a flat circle. I just, uh, don't. Oh man. Don't mind me. So what? It's a clock. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I just, just, fucking what's his face? Matthew McConaughey, man. The dude's weird. Hop in your Lincoln and have a good time. You're, you're gonna have a good time. You're gonna have a good time. Uh, fiddling around with those buggers. If you hop in your Lincoln when you're supposed to get in your, wait, if you hop in your <laughs> Ford when you're supposed to get in your Lincoln, you're gonna have a bad time. Yes. Yes, that sounds pretty bad. <laughs> is that dude still around? What has he done? Oh, yeah. Now? Matthew McConaughey? Yeah. What the hell? What is the last movie he did? Last movie I saw Magic was Mike 2? Interstellar. Interstellar was really good. I liked is it a lot. Didn't it? Yeah. I yeah. haven't seen it. The end gets super fucking weird, but it's also interesting. It's like 2001 for our generation. Yeah. Mm. So, I know I feel really, like, weak about this. Uh, but I'm so proud of myself today. Okay. Um, what did you do? I took a needle to the arm and didn't pass out. Oh. Hey, there you go. I, the last... You, they usually bother you so much that you would pass out? The last time I had blood work done, I almost passed out. Really? Yeah. I, I mean, I really don't like needles, but needles combined with blood, that, uh... Uh, shame to admit it, but that's, that is the case. Hey, recognize your fears, that's step one. I mean, some, I have more unreasonable fears. Like, spiders? Ooh. For me? Yeah. Bugs in general, I hate bugs. Yeah, bugs. Snakes. Bugs, bugs. Don't want to deal with them. 
What are you, Indiana Jones? Birds? Snakes. I... What kind of birds? Uh, I'm not really birds. I just, I don't like the fact that you, you can't, you can't really, if let's say a bird wanted to fuck with you, he could do a really good job. Like, he can fly, you where, can't, where, you like can't a, do shit. A tiger, you can keep a tiger in front of you, you know, you could probably, like, box a tiger, but a bird, um, he's so fast. That's debatable. <laughs> okay. I mean, you, you could box a tiger, you would lose, yeah. most cases, but you could actually Put awesome. him up. Oh. It would be easier to hit a tiger. It would be easier to hit a tiger than it would to hit a bird. That's what yeah, I'm right. saying. Yes. Oh, wouldn't that be funny if you tried? If you squared up with a tiger, you socked him in the jaw, and he was just like, <laughs> <laughs> just walks away. <laughs> so oh, he got salty. <laughs> like, oh, I wasn't expecting that. Shit. Come out of here. <laughs> hey, by the way, Twain. Your why, punch is great! Why did your sister and your brother-in-law think that Calvin from Calvin and Hobbes was Tigger? Was Tigger? Oh my fucking god! They're so, not even uh, close. I didn't even know Yeah, my, my nephew has a, uh, god damn it. He's got a Calvin. What, is the bird dead? Uh, it's going to die if we don't help it. Dude, go kill that hub. I'm hub. trying to get over there. <laughs> what was that, Tony? I think I'm going to be able to kill him. <laughs> as long as Twain can get over... Um, fast enough, I should be able to destroy him. What are you, you're focusing on these red hubs. I, I can't. I can't get over to the purple goblin with Tommy, so it doesn't make sense to so, go over there. Because can I? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, great. Get wrecked, family. Yeah. Ky Ky is there to save the day. Here he comes as to save the day. As per usual. Oh, blocked. Oh, Block, oh, motherfucker. Oh. Block your counter attack. God damn it. So yeah, Twain just needs to get close enough to uh, to um, attack the goblin with ice, because gobos are we against ice. Yes, hmm. correct. I'm doing this for the XP. Don't worry about why it's weird, because it is weird. But yeah, we must do this the correct way, as to not hurt our friend. There we go, and he will die. But you'll hurt KY, isn't he your friend? No, I won't hurt KY. I did it to the left of the goblin, not behind the goblin. Oh. Give me that level. Now die. Oh. Well done, nice. Twain. Andy well done, me. Level. I'll pat myself on the back later after we kill the rest of these gobos. All right. Uh, so yeah, I, I, uh, the last time I had blood drawn was about five years ago, and I had like four... Four to five vials taken for various different Jesus. things. Jesus. What is it, like a pint? Uh, less than a pint? It might, It's less than a pint, I think. It's got to be. Because, I mean, you can have some pretty big vials, but usually... No, yeah, they're not, they're not... They're not... They weren't... Because how many pints are in a, the human body? Uh, I don't know. It was just two pints in a quart. Yeah, there well, wasn't a pint. How many but, quarts are... Okay, this doesn't help. Um, There's three spoons and a tablespoon. Take, like, two gills. I want to say, like, whereas, six pints. How many tablespoons is that? Of blood. Uh, I can find out for you. But yeah, so <laughs> I had four tablespoons of blood. I had four to five vials, and it, it obviously wasn't very much because I almost passed out. And I told my fiance, like, "Oh man, I had so much blood drawn for me, like four to five vials," and she's like, "That's like nothing." And I'm like, it? "I don't think you're correct, but you are in nursing school, and I at the time, and I trust that you are correct in your assessment that I am." just super soft. So, what? What? Well, what? He <laughs> seems well enough. A lucky one, this. Let's hope he's got a sense of gratitude, eh? <laughs> so, yeah, I got two vials today, and that was significantly better than four to five. What a horrible way to divide a pint. 32 tablespoons. So six pints? Yeah. That's uh, roughly 190 tablespoons of blood. How many pints are there, everybody? Uh, let's find out. Because it varies slightly hey, per person. So do we get the hop? Do we get the me. the chocobo in our party? Yes. Are you gonna show him to us? I sure. Can we give him job point? Does he get job points? Uh, no. He has a set abilities. Oh. Okay, eight pints for an average person. This changes according to how big or small the person is. Eight pints? 
Yeah. Oh, that's more than so I thought. So somebody like me might have like eight and a half. Are you calling yourself above average? I'm 6'3", 300 pounds. Yes, I'm above average. Oh, so we're talking about body structure. You said the average person. I also do have a large frame. Yeah. Broad shoulders, broad hips. So when you said like the fridge. average person. Those hips about, don't lie. Eight points. Eight, eight points. Eight points on their license. They're about to get <laughs> 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 All right. Well, the next episode of Students of Gaming... Uh, maybe we'll go into my irrational fear of needles a bit more. Or maybe not. Let's do it! Maybe I'll forget that I ever talked to anybody about this. Uh, but in any case, Gafgarian is now Southern. So we That's have right. that now. Excellent. Um, so until next time, everyone, class is missed.